In today's greatest story joke, we touch a sensitive nerve with an hilarious outcome. Ever felt like Cupid needs a GPS and DNA test instead of a bow and arrow? Today's joke is all about dads with hearts of gold and maybe a touch of matchmaking amnesia with a drop of telenovela without the dramatic music, of course. Get ready for a hilarious joke of mistaken identities, blind love and one very confused son but let us briefly delve into some history before we attack the comedy. Adultery is probably as old as the mountains. Indeed, adultery seems to be as universal and, in some instances, as common as marriage. The Code of Hammurabi, dating back almost 4,000 years ago in Babylonia, provided a punishment of death by drowning for adultery. In ancient Greece and in Roman law, an offending female spouse could be killed but men were not severely punished. This is the base for our joke today. So buckle up and smell the incest in this very funny joke. One day the son burst into the living room, his heart doing a jig that would make a tap dancer jealous. Dad, I'm head over heels in love. Like, literally, I keep tripping over my own feet when I see her. The father replied, son, that's unique. Who's the lucky fish in your pond? The boy answered, Emma. Dad answering with his eyes wide like a cartoon character. Emma, isn't she? The neighbor's daughter, yes. The son replied, his stomach performing a synchronized butterfly backflip routine worthy of a gold medal. The dad answered, Oh no, son, you can't date her. She might be your sister, but don't tell your mother. The son was very disappointed and just walked away. Two weeks later, the son, ever the optimist, bounced back with another love of his life announcement. Dad, Cupid struck again, he declared, eyes shining with puppy dog fever. This time, it's Jennifer. The dad replied, oh no son, I would stay away from her as well. She might also be your sister too. So the son walked away once again extremely disappointed in his father. The son continued his whirlwind tour of near incestuous crushes, leaving a trail of confused girls and increasingly exasperated sighs from his dad. Maybe Cupid needed an optometrist, or perhaps the son just had a thing for forbidden fruit. One day the son had enough. He went to tell his mother all about this. After telling her the whole story, he said to her, look mom, I admit my dating pool might be a tad shallow, but come on. Eight girls, and dad thinks they're all related to me. Maybe I should start carrying a family tree flowchart on first dates to clear things up. The mother looked at her son in a comfort way and said, date whoever you want to date my son, because what your dad don't know is that he is not your real father either. If you liked our joke, then please watch our next joke by clicking here.